answer your question. Whatever the fans want, that's what we're going to give them. But we're going to do it on our terms. And I'm going to continue to say that, on our terms. We're not going to go out there again and overpay a fighter just because y'all say he's a big name fighter. It don't work like that. The business don't work like that. We're not in the, in the business of fucking off money like some of these other promoters. Same writers out here, they're praised. Canelo, um, you got you got so many young champions. Come up here. They're, they're overlooked guys. Come on, come on up here. Hammer. They're overlooked guys. They're overlooked guys like you. Unbelievable fighter. One of the best fighters in the sport of boxing today. One of the best. They're overlooked guys like you. Little young kid right here, they'll overlook him. They, but hey, you can take a guy like Canelo, this guy can do um, he can pick and choose who he want to fight. And, and I'm going to tell you the truth about Canelo. Motherfucker easy, man. He can't walk. <laughs> y'all sitting up here, y'all praising this dude. This dude was nothing. I was almost 40 years old when I, when I cooked this dude. Easy. Y'all y'all, 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 always disrespecting our fighters. Um, I just left the WBC boxing convention. I, I flew out to Mexico City for all the fighters. Not just black fighters. When I, I went to Mexico City for all fighters. Every fighter should be treated fair and everybody should be on the even playing field. Mm-hmm. So I flew to Mexico to meet with the WBC, to meet with uh, different referees, different officials, <coughs> so fighters can be treated fair.